have you heard about the hottest places to buy? Decentraland, Axie Infinity, Sandbox? If those mean nothing to you, stay tuned. That's what we're going to talk about in this episode. Hey guys, I'm Nicholas Schrader, one half of the Schrader Brothers, Berkshire Hathaway, Results Realty. And let me give a little disclaimer before we start this video. The information that I have and that I have been trying to gather is enough to only scratch the surface on this topic. So it's more of just something to kind of uh, just whet the appetite so you hopefully are willing to dig into it a little bit more on your own. So now we can get started. So there is a major, major, major push right now for real estate in the digital world. What in the world does that mean? If you think back to games like The Sims or maybe even, I believe, uh, Roblox, those lands are places where you can develop and create a world. Well, now with the advancement of cryptocurrency, and if you are familiar with things like NFTs, non-fungible tokens, now you have places that are called metaverses, which are lands that are online in the cloud, and they live on the blockchain. And what you can do in these spaces is you can buy land. Now, why in the world would you want to buy land in a digital world? And what are they going for? Well, there's been a massive, massive increase in the interest and the pricing of these virtual digital land purchases. You can pick them up for as little as maybe a few dollars or they've gone for north of a million dollars. That's right. There is digital real estate that is selling for north of a million dollars, almost two million dollars. Look it up. There is also real estate funds that allow investors to invest as a group into a group of investors so that you can purchase more land. I know this sounds unbelievable, but it is definitely something that needs to be talked about. You have land such as Decentraland, which is a one of the, probably one of the first ones. Again, I'm only scratching the surface on the knowledge that I have. You have Decentraland, you have Axie Infinity, you have Sandbox, and a number of other lands that people are getting involved in. Now, what do you do with this land once you get it? Well, believe it or not, you can develop your land. And how would you do that? Once you purchase your land, which it's usually purchased in either something like the cryptocurrency of Ethereum, or a lot of these metaverses have their own currency within, and you would purchase that currency so you could purchase land. Again, I know this seems amazingly just out there, but it's happening. And people are making a lot of money flipping land. So once you have the land, then you can purchase NFTs, which are non-fungible tokens, in the forms of buildings. And then on buildings, you can actually have a business in this land that is revenue generating. These lands are doing all kinds of things. Just this past weekend in Decentraland, they had a music festival with some rather large name artists performing and had meet and greets. Again, I know this sounds totally out there, but it's happening. I encourage you to check this out. So if you're looking for something that is going to be possibly the next big thing, check out virtual lands. There's a lot of places you can go. You wanna go onto a NFT marketplace, there's a number of those. You can see what these are selling for. You go to, I believe it is nonfungible.com. Nonfungible being the first two letters of NFT, which is non-fungible token, which is actually what this land is considered. So it is an investment. Uh, again, it can be anywhere from a couple dollars up to you know, almost $2 million, depending on, get this, where the land is in relation to the happening areas of that metaverse you are in an area that is close to the center of the city or possibly maybe near the arts district or the music district. Yes, those exist in these lands. Property could be more expensive because it is more valuable, just like 
traditional real estate, location, 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 it also matters in the digital world. So I encourage you to kind of fact check me. Go check out OpenSea.io. That is a NFT marketplace. You can browse through there. You can see a lot of other NFTs as well, but being as though we're talking about real estate, you can click on virtual lands and you can see what different pieces of land are selling for. You purchase essentially a pixel of land or you can package it together and have a bigger piece of land so you can do more things, develop it better in hopes of having a revenue generating parcel of land. I know this is virtually impossible to explain to a lot of people that don't understand what the digital world is. And I can only, again, scratch the surface. It is something I am personally trying to learn about because it is very, very intriguing. And there is a lot of money changing hands in this space. So again, definitely check it out. It is digital land. Again, there is a lot of metaverses. The three that come to mind just for me personally, just from reading are again, Decentraland, which you can go to Decentraland.com. Sandbox, you'll have to Google it, and Axie Infinity, which is A-X-I-E Infinity. Those are three very popular lands that people are getting involved in and purchasing land and turning revenues while flipping land. <sighs> this was a tough one because it is so advanced. There's so many things that are happening in this space. I just want everybody to kind of know if you're looking to invest into real estate, this is not something that I as a real estate agent can help you with because this is in a decentralized world, but it is definitely something to look into, learn about, and know about because I believe it is a big part of our future. So, Guys, we do these videos each and every Monday to try and help either inform the consumer, the buyer, the seller, or just let people know about the great state of Florida, which this is probably none of those. It is more for the consumer that is investing in virtual land. Again, I am not quite there yet, but I am trying to be, so I do encourage you to check that out. Guys, you can check out all of our information. Uh, you can look at properties, real property. You can learn about Justin or myself. You can check out the blogs, and of course, you can check out all the videos by going to our website at liveflowlife.com. Again, the website has just been totally revamped within the last month or two. Um, I'm really happy with the way it turned out. Uh, please leave a comment. Uh, let us know if there's something you would like to see us do a video on. I'm more than happy to you know, look over those topics and see if it's something that we can somewhat intelligently uh, talk about. Um, obviously, please click the like, the subscribe, all that. We do appreciate that. And of course, if, you can, if we can ever help you in any way, shape, or form, whether it's just about real estate in general or whether it is about the state of Florida, you know, where we love to you know, live flow life. That's what we do. That is our hashtag. That is our website. That is our brand, Live Flow Life. If we can help you with any of those, please do not hesitate to reach out. We love talking to you guys. So thanks again for tuning in. I know this one was was out there, but definitely something to look into. You know, read a few articles, listen to a few podcasts. You will be amazed. So thanks again, guys. Hope you have a great day, and we'll talk to you soon.